Fresh Fire. What is up, Joe Crew? It is me, Joe Crew DMD, and we got it. Today, we got it. It's finally here. The One Piece starter decks. The One Piece starter decks are here. These are all four starters. I'm going to show you guys all four starters in this video. I am so hyped. I don't know if you guys have been following the channel, but if you have, you know I've been wishing for a One Piece card game for over a year now. I've been making videos on every kind of One Piece card I can find. Anything One Piece related that is a trading card, I've been making a video. I've been asking for a card game, and finally, it has arrived. We're getting a one piece card game it is here the starter decks are out in japan the booster set is being released on july 22nd and i will have booster boxes to open on the channel as soon as i can get my hands on them probably that weekend so stay tuned come check that out i am so hyped to see these cards in person i've been looking at every kind of one piece card i can see and they all look so good everything that i've seen online about these has looked amazing so i'm going to try and give you guys the best look at these cards that i possibly can so i'm going to go through each starter and show you guys the cards so you you can see what they look like but i am so insanely hyped for this this is like a dream come true honestly for me so i am so glad to have these cards in my hand shout out to my friends in japan for getting these cards to me as fast as possible i thoroughly appreciate your support in this endeavor if this is your first time here and you guys want to see one piece card stuff i'm going to be opening all of it i'm going to be opening every single one piece card thing that you can see i'm going to be doing competitive and casual deck profiles playthroughs everything one piece card game i'm doing it all i am on the ship the holy hexagon is here the joe crew is going in for the one piece card game so thank you so much and now it's time to look at these cards in person i can hardly contain myself but let's get into it all right here they are these things are about the size of mangas which is pretty cool uh this is the luffy deck art this is the kid deck art this is the kaido deck art and this is the crocodile deck art so this is the warlords deck beast pirates uh worst generation pirates and straw hats so to see these in person finally after all this time i am so freaking hyped about this wow 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 yeah booster boxes i'm gonna have booster boxes i'm gonna be opening cases a couple cases probably do a live stream wow 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 oh my god though oh my god though this is it this is the card these are the cards these are the actual one piece cards and not just bootleg cards that i'm making on my own here to try and play this game this game is so insanely fun too i've been having so much fun playing it but let's get in here and take a look at these cards i think these are the don't this is the dawn deck back here also and this is it yeah i mean these are looking like ebs parallel foils from the recent set that's kind of the vibe i'm getting from these foils and i'm gonna spend more time looking at the foils so oh man this nine drop kaido is sick look at his face he is so pissed this is fantastic get a closer look in here at these these look the art on here is so clean foils look outstanding i love what they're doing on the side with these cards also really really good Queen looking tough. Jack looking tough as heck. Who's who coming through. There are two who's who. I thought there were gonna be four, but these are the ratios here. So there's two Brachio Bomber. There are four Bolo Breaths. So those ratios were right initially. Four Onigashima, this card's crazy. And here's the Don deck. Don, 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 Don. All donned up. I got them all donned up and got nowhere to go. That's what you say when you have all 10 Don. This game design is absolutely amazing. The cards feel really nice too. They feel really smooth. They feel clean. They got nice rounded edges. I think we're gonna be seeing a similar. Look at that, so shiny. The stuff that's going on in the background, that like flame circle coming out behind King. Yeah, these definitely blow my bootleg cards out of the water. I am so hyped to be holding these in my hand. How freaking amazing is that? Oh, soap. The rest of these are non-foil, but even the non-foils just look awesome. Oh man, this art looks so good. This is like looking at the reveals and then actually having these in hand. The cardstock feels so nice. It's so smooth. It's got this really nice matte finish. Jin Rummy's earrings look super real. I am, I am loving this. I am loving everything about this. This is so dang good. Page one looking like a total champ here. And Durek, Durek Sama. Very good. So that's the Kaido deck. Next up, we got the Seven Warlords deck, the Crocodile deck. Let's strip on this thing and see what's inside here. Oh man, this is, this is a dream. This is honestly a dream come true. I have been waiting. I've been waiting a long time for this game. And uh, I am so hyped that it's here. I'm so hyped that they've done such an amazing job designing it. I think this is a little pamphlet here, kind of teach you how to play sort of thing. But, oh, 
Oh, yo, look at that. Oh, my God. Crocodile. Crocodile. Don Quixote do Flamingo. What a guy. What an absolute villain. Look at that look on his face. He's just, he is ready to take a lick. Take a look. Man, look how shiny this is. They're so shiny. Oh, wow. I love the art. I love how they're using the characters inside and outside of the frame. Just the composition of these and the way they're doing the foiling, the cool stuff that's going on around the edge and the border of the card. Just, it looks so dang good. These are amazing. I couldn't have asked for more. All right, and here's the rest of the deck just so you guys can see the ratios. Jimbe looking real tough. Trafalgar Law. Boom. Shambles, Puma with the paw paw buggy. If you know about buggy, if you if you're current and you know the deal on buggy, I'm not gonna spoil anything. But buggy basically just broke the internet. Boa Hancock makes her way in. I believe she's a blocker. All right, let's check out this leader and the don 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 don. I love that they decided to call the energy system Dawn. I think that's one of the coolest things. And I love these compasses behind the characters also. I mean, look at that hook. Look at this man and his hook. He's up to good. He's up to no good. You know it. But I mean, you know, this guy comes around. I don't want to spoil anything, but Crocodile is definitely one of my favorite characters. So pretty cool that he gets a leader card. I think he definitely deserves it. And this is the Crocodile five drop. Yo. These look so sick. You really can't tell from, I mean, I ho hopefully you guys will be able to get a better idea from these videos. I'm trying to do them as high quality as I can so you can really see how crisp these pictures are. But in person, these are just, these are amazing. I've never seen parallel foils like this. I think, you know, I was so amazed when I saw the rise of the Unison Warrior and when Unison Warrior came out, the change in the parallel foils. But these are, I would say these are above them. They're somehow matte, which is really cool. Gecko Moria looking like a real schmizer. Mihawk, very cool. Very, very cool. Blackbeard coming through. Tichi, what a schmizak. All right. Yo, these cards are looking fantastic. This is probably the deck I know the least about. But, ooh, I like that. And here we go. Don, 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 don. And we're all donned up and nowhere to go. All right, so next up, we're going to check out this kid deck. These supernovas or worst generation pirates whatever you want to call them i like the idea i like the concept of worst generation i think it's pretty cool and ooh, wow yo 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 this is so sick oh my god i can't believe i'm holding these in my hands after all of the one piece cards that i procured and looked at and theorized about what they're gonna look like i i it's absolutely amazing to have these to have these in my actual hands in my real hands these are my real hands and i have these real one piece cards in my real hands yo this card is so sick i think this is the coolest parallel foil so far wow it just looks so good from so many different angles you you know however you turn it it just looks fantastic the art is so clean on these manga style this is like this is you know color walk and i believe oda actually worked on this game as well which is really really cool but these look absolutely gorgeous so so good looking this is a crazy card too i mean for this skill and all this and to also have counter power that's like pretty wild all right here we got the rest of the deck here these are the ratios if you want to know i think they're available online i like this kobe card a lot also i think this kobe card is awesome very, very cool card. Jewelry Bonnie, that's a good card as well. Scratch Man Apu. And we got, is there a plus 2k counter? It might be in the other side of the deck. Pretty sure every deck has a couple plus 2k counters, but a lot of them are plus 1k counters. Do here, here, oh man. Kid looking like a menace. Wow, this leader's pretty cool. You get to re-stand something by exhausting three dawn. I think that's really good. These these compasses are so rad. I love it. I love the I love the design concept. This it's very, very cool. They've done an amazing job with this game, and I think the ceiling is just so high for where this game can go. Oh, this is gonna be the kid foil back here. Wow, killer looks sick. That is so sick. I can't wait to see this kid card. Oh yo, it's so shiny. This is so sick. Yo, look at that. I need I need just need to shut up for a second oh my god this is too cool this is way too cool oh man that i love how this breaks the border and is going off the border of the card and you have the onomatopoeia katakana or i think this is katakana but the text that's on here as well worked in with this text it just so insanely cool kids looking so tough it really gives you like the feeling of how massive this thing is that he's created on his arm you feel the scale and the size when looking at this card and this card's pretty good also it's a blocker that restands so it's pretty pretty cool you know 7k blocker is pretty tough stuff and here's the rest of the deck we got drake and some of the extra cards or event cards they're called excuse me but i didn't see any 2k counters 
Dun, 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 dun. Oh yeah, Scratch Man Apu. There's our 2K counters and there's four of them. And here it is, the deck that we've all been waiting for, the Straw Hats. This art just looks so awesome. I love this image. I love the style. I think this is the game, the style of the game art that just looks really good. Mugiwara no Rufi. Oh man, I feel like I can't look. It's gonna burn my eyes. It's gonna look so good. I'm gonna hurt myself if I look too long. Oh, yo, yo, so sick, so insanely sick. Oh man, I'm gonna start with this side because I'm pretty sure the, I'm pretty sure the uh, Bomb Luffy is in the other stack. So we'll take a look at Zoro here. Zoro's a great card too. He is three, so he's vulnerable to a lot of removal, but dang, look at that. That is a gorgeous piece of cardboard if I've ever seen it. If I've ever seen cardboard that looks gorgeous, it's this one. And this card, I'm pretty sure this, if he has a Dawn on him, I'm pretty sure he stays at 6K on your opponent's turn, which is pretty rad for a three energy card to be at 6K for them to have to swing into. So I'm pretty sure the Dawn next one stays. I might be wrong about that, but that's, I believe that's how that works. Oh, so dang good. These look so sick. And through the rest of the deck here, this is the worst card in the deck. It's so bad. There's like only one card that he swings through. Karu, looking cute as heck. Sanji, Sanji is an awesome card. I love this card, but I think the main set Sanji is better actually. Jinbei is a great card as well. I can't believe, I've been I've been playing with proxies of these for so long. So, oh, Nami's looking fantastic. Very excellent. Such a good card too. I think she's gonna be a staple in pretty much every red deck. So I'm looking forward to when they reprint her because I'm sure they will. Here we go, this is it. The Luffy five drop is going to be in here i am i'm most excited to see that card for sure it's so good oh wow look at that leader this art is so sick honestly i kind of i don't know if that is the pre-release art that they've spoiled but i kind of like this one better i just love this original art style and he looks so ready to adventure such a good look so cool you know this belt flying up and this pose he's in he's ready to fight and party like the luffy we know and love fantastic we got vivi Clean looking card. Furanki. Furish fire. Brooks. There's only two Brooks. I wish there were more Brooks because this counter power is so valuable. The card skill isn't amazing, but plus 2k counters are just so. Oh. <gasps> Yo, this looks so sick. Oh my goodness. Look at him. He just rolls up. You know how fast he just got there and he just goes. <sighs> you can like see the air coming out of his nose he's so pissed he's ready to punch somebody he is ready to knock somebody's lights out knock your lights out luffy and look at that the way the hat just breaks the border of the frame of the card it's just this composition is amazing it looks so freaking good i love this his hair is coming out oh man i this card this card's also really good you know not being able to block an attack is very strong and he's going to be an 8k when he's swinging into stuff so it's it's a strong card very very useful and it looks Fantastic. It's such a good looking card. Oh my god. Oh god, I'm gonna hurt my eyes if I keep looking. I gotta look away. Look away. Avert your eyes. You guys look. I'm not gonna look. Ah, oh, I can't look. Ah, oh, it looks so good. Ah, oh, it's too good. It's too painful. I'm gonna need to see an eye doctor. I've seen too many things. Alright, guard a point. Guard a point. Um Gamma Gamma no Jet Pistol. And Diablo Jam. Diablo Jam is actually a really good card. Well, Sunny looks great as well. And don 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 don. I'm all donned up. It's somewhere to go. I feel like we just kind of need to go through these foils again. So I'm gonna run through them one more time so you guys can get a good look at these. And I'm actually gonna zoom in as much as I can so you guys can really see the art as much as possible and just kind of run through each one full screen so you guys can just see how shiny and amazing these cards look. They are gorgeous. So dang cool. King, you can see like the printing quality and the line work just looks so insanely awesome. And where they decide to break the frame and not break the frame with continuing the art, I think it's, it's so cool. These cards look so great. I can't wait to see the main set stuff. The main set stuff is looking really, really sick. Also, they just revealed the secret rares recently, and I think people are kind of sleeping on how sick they are. They look crazy, crazy shiny, so I think they're the kind of thing that you, can, you need to see in person to really be able to evaluate how good they look. But I think there's some really subtle textures in them. I love how they're all gold around the border, but this will hold me over for two weeks before we get those boosters, and I am gonna be stripping the night away. There's gonna be 
there's going to be a lot of one piece cards open on this channel so make sure to hit that subscription button if you guys like this stuff and you want to see more of it i will be doing all of it all the japanese all the japanese cards all the english cards yo this card is just this card's too cool this is like too epic i love this i love this foil it's so sick dang it's so dang shiny so dang shiny kid just looks so tough he's got such a great attitude i love this guy so awesome zoro oh man these cards look so dang good oh man yo ho ho sha wow it's the compass looks so shiny next to him i love this card this leader's so fun to play too just so much value and here he is, the boy. You can literally see the air coming out of his nose with how pissed he is. That one vein in his forehead, you do not want to mess with this guy. This is the kind of guy who you do not want to mess with the friends of. Wow, I'm like, I'm blown away right now. My, my brain has exploded past my shell of my head. Uh, I hope you guys enjoyed checking these out. I absolutely love checking these out. I'm still like freaking out. I feel like I'm shaking from seeing these in person. Finally, there's been so much anticipation that's worked up to this point. So excited, the main set stuff. My understanding is you get an alt art in each box and the alt arts all look like they have texture fo on the foiling. They just, I'm super, super psyched. The only one we've had a really good look at so far is Law. The Law alt art looks absolutely stunning. So I'm just super psyched to see those. Thank you guys for coming by and watching this. There's gonna be a lot more, two weeks. As soon as the booster set comes out, I'm gonna be stripping a case. I'm gonna do a case opening. I'm gonna do box openings. I'm gonna do case live streams. So definitely make sure to check it out. Hit that little notification bell so you guys don't miss when I'm going live and checking these things out. And I am a dentist. I can't end without doing a dental tooth tip. So my dental tooth tip to you would be, hopefully a lot of people are watching this video. So I'm just gonna go through my hygiene routine and I hope you guys can implement some of this stuff into your hygiene routine so you can best take care of your teeth because your teeth are crystals and crystals are treasure and pirates love pr treasure so you should treasure your teeth and take care of them brush twice a day powered brush sonicare 4700 i have videos on how to use it you can check out my tiktok at dental.dmd you can check out my instagram at dental.dmd there's videos on how to use a power toothbrush properly listerine ultra clean flosser once a day just at night chill on the couch read manga play games whatever it is just get that flosser in there and floss 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 it makes such a huge difference shower flosser water pick that screws into your shower head you use the three of those things and you use them properly i promise you you will save yourself tens of thousands of dollars over the course of your life so invest make the small investment in those things learn how to use them check out my tutorial videos on my dental.dmd instagram page and take care of your teeth because as you get older they take care of you and you all know how much luffy loves eating it's not very fun to eat without your teeth so keep them healthy thank you so much i'm i'm still blown away i can't believe these are sitting in front of me my, my brain is exploding by the minute anyway i hope you guys enjoyed this video i'll see you in the next one johnny bye bye